Is it possible to assign a hoodie case to a specific person? I would really like your help. KSK, what are you getting yourself into, bro? And we're finally back with episode 42 of this Let's Play. It's your boy Zero. And it's your boy Bio. And, uh, yeah, like I said, episode 42. Let's see uh, what we can pull off. Uh, where can I not? Uh, something's telling me we left off somewhere and I don't remember where. Uh, cause, I don't remember either. Uh, cause we were, I was supposed to... Oh, wait, no, I'm supposed, I should be going back to Huddy. That's what I should be doing. So let's do that first. I'm so smart. How you been, Bio? How you doing? Yo, I've been doing great. How have you been? I've been um, alive. I don't know uh, how. When was the last time we recorded? A month ago? Two months? Uh, about two and a half months ago? I was just slap you. Yeah, we've been slacking. Like, quite literally, just slacking. And uh, I'm not happy about it, but we have put out quite a few videos on TSG. Um, one video that's been doing amazing. Thank you, everyone who's been watching. The Digimon World 3 video I created recently. Literally our best performing video to date. And I just wanted to give a quick thank you to everybody who has subscribed and watched the video and commented on, on it. I'm very, very happy. So when we're doing the Digimon World 3, let's play. Well, I mean, we could... But it's a grind fest. We'd be using cheat codes to get through that game faster. Which cheat I'm not codes. against doing. I guess that's fair. I, I didn't even know you could use cheat codes for Digimon World 3. Well, it's a PS1 game. I, I guess if you use it that well, like through an emulator? Yeah. Oh, uh, yeah, I guess. You know, I never use an emulator cheat code, so I wouldn't know how that works. Oh, dude, I used to... I, I used to use cheat codes all over the freaking place. You don't understand. Uh, GBA, freaking, uh, G Game Boy Color, uh, N64 emulator, PS PS1 emulator. Mm -hmm. Uh, I have a nephew that actually had the Codemasters memory card and disc for the PS2, which allowed me to use cheat codes on the PS2 physically, which I was never able to do back in the day on the PS1 because I didn't have that stuff. But boy, what did that open up doors, I'm telling you. The stuff we used to do. I don't know what you used to do. You know, just do shit. Uh, Freaking uh, get items we needed. Um, <clears throat> uh, beat the game faster. Freaking unlock some things we weren't supposed to do. Characters we can unlock that we weren't supposed to. It was fun. Alright, well then we should definitely do it for Digimon World 3. Yeah, why not? We'll figure we'll figure it out whether we can pull it off or not, whether we should or not. Um, yeah, you can also add some voice works into it if you really wanted to. Well, I mean, I have to warn you. Digimon World 3 is similar to Digimon Story Hacker's Memory, but not exact. Digimon World 3 is nothing like Hacker's Memory. What? Similarities being that they're actually JRPGs. Oh. You know, and it actually has a story where there's a lot of text boxes. So yeah, we could yeah, no, do no, voice acting, not... but I mean, like if you do a lo like a production work, like if you were to do like mini episodic episodes, you know what I'm saying? Like yeah, uh, like like a Team Four Star Bridge episode. I see what you mean. Yeah, no, it yeah. wouldn't be the same as this. No, it wouldn't be. Um, but yeah, uh, would you like to be you? Oh shit! I forgot to sound like you. I mean, dude, just do just do your voice. It doesn't matter. Ah, uh, Kisuke, hey there. I'm pretty sure you's a guy, but whatever. I know. Uh, um, it's just that I've got something on my mind. Uh, you? Are you okay there, bro? <laughs> I can't really handle it by myself. It's a pretty tricky problem. Is it possible to assign a huddy case to a specific person? I would really like your help. Keisuke, what are you getting yourself into, bro? 
Great, I'll send you the case. Please take a look when you get some time. And like that, we figured it out. That's what, what happens, figure? boys and girls, when you don't play for a while. You end up forgetting. I do. I still don't, I still don't, I still don't know what happened in the storyline. I mean, it's been a while, but we'll we'll get through the story. You know, we'll record more episodes and get through this game. I just really need to stop having us put on, you know, JRPGs on the channel because they literally take forever to beat. What is it? What is this guy looking at? I mean, I, if he makes you... F oh. Sorry. I made the video playing on the screen. I'm super stoked to see it played on, on such a bustling street. Was he always there? I think so. I mean, I don't know. I was going to say, if it makes you feel any better, I've been playing Persona 5 for, five, for three years now. Oof. Well, and if I'm it makes you if it makes you feel any better, it no. literally took me from 2002 till like 2008 to beat Digimon World 3 in my first personal playthrough. I have yet to beat Digimon World 3. I just know of it. Rip. If anything, it took me for me 10 years to beat Digimon World 1 from cuz I didn't know what to do as a kid until I got into high school. Oof. I mean, same here. Uh, all right, so you were saying you were playing it for what? Three years now, and you're on how many episodes? Episode 54. Oof. And I just now got to Haru's pa pa Palace, or Dad's Palace. Quadruple oof. All right. Lend me your one day girlfriend. Oh my yeah, this geez, is... that's, that's why I made the voice. You can't you can't say anything. Uh I'm starting to think that you is just a tomboy who's acting as a boy for whatever reason. So we'll, we'll see. We'll see. A friend asked me to verify some places, but I'm too embarrassed to go alone. I want you to help Keisuke. What the fuck are we doing? The guy in the pose as a girl. All right, a regular Bugs Bunny. Let's go. Or he's posing as a girl. Who knows? It's a case from you. This must be what he was talking about at K Cafe. What does he mean by verification? He's going to check to see if you have a. Hey yo. When I contacted him, he said he's in Tokyo. He's in Tokyo Handy. I'll start there. Oh, a Handy. I see what's going on. Alright guys, time to put the kids to bed. This is getting a little saucy. First, let's feed that addiction of mine. Ooh, Gargoyle Mon. Gargoyle, well, well, gargoyle not Gargo. I know. Yeah. I heard right. what you said. I didn't. I didn't hear what you said. Alright, uh, let's get this going. <gasps> Hi, thanks for taking my case. So, about the case. To tell the truth, I want you to go to some potential date spots with me. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I know, it sounds a bit weird, but this is Japan. Yeah. Don't get the wrong idea, I'm not up to anything shade MD. Uh, yeah, because you're not blushing like crazy at all, whatsoever. My friend asked me to verify date spots for him to go with his girlfriend. Right. At first, I turned him down because I was too embarrassed, but he insisted. So you and this other friend can't go? It has to be Keisuke? Yes, yes, yes. He, go, he goes to a different school than yours. So please, if only to help me help my friend, come with me. Right? Are you sure I'm the right choice? Wouldn't it be better to ask a girl? Which choice, bro? Uh, go, go, call him out. Call him a girl. Wouldn't it be better to ask a girl? A, oh. a girl? What are you talking about? There's no way I can invite a girl. I don't know any. Bullshit! So, will you go out with me? Well, will you go with me? That's what oh, the text says. Oh, I, I misread. I, I foreshadow the events. So will you go with me? Thank you. I knew you. I could. I knew I could count on you. 
All right, let's go to the first place, the aquarium, so I can be wet. Eh, eh, eh. Uh, yeah, the aquarium. Oh, so you's actually following us. That's cool. Just checking that ass. Well, thankfully, the aquarium's right. Gross. Oh, look. A sh How do you pronounce that word? Shoal. A, sh a shoal? Yeah. You just made that up. Uh, I'm not. I'm not making it up. Oh, look. A shoal of tiny fishes is swimming over. Oh, sorry. I haven't been to an aquarium in ages. I'm so excited. I need to verify this location. Let's get started. Can you play the girlfriend? I'll be the boyfriend. Right. I thought, see, I, said, I thought that would be the reverse. I forgot he wanted, he wanted to be the dominant one. Oh, my. Ha! <laughs> Case King. If we don't set the mood... How are we supposed to verify whether or not this place would make a good date spot? I wouldn't be very good at playing the girl. You do it. You have the ass. Hmm. It's a case. Oh, you, it's you a case. You I guess challenge. I don't have a choice. I'll play the challenge boyfriend. Him. Okay, let's get started. All you right, let, let's him. challenge him. Let's challenge him. I'll play the boyfriend. Oh, come on. It wouldn't be so bad. Just humor me for the day. Uh. Okay, now we have our rose, so let's start. This isn't weird whatsoever. You said you wanted to come here, didn't you? Wow, you, you remembered. How sweet. Of course, I'd never forget something like that. Oh, look, a clownfish. Isn't it cute? Why is he doing the pose, too? Bananas. <laughs> but not as cute as you, sweetie. Really? <laughs> you didn't even say it. Um. Hello? I'm right here. Oh, okay. You get mad quiet. I I'm listening. Ah, uh, there's a penguin show over there. Let's go. How long do we have to do this for? You aren't supposed to run in an aquarium, you? i go with the first option since we yeah. have to do this for 30 minutes. Yeah, well, honestly. Oh, it's over. Wow, that was fun. And you were a natural. I almost forgot you weren't a girl. Oh. Uh, okay. Now, let's go to an amusement park and a, a ride a Ferris wheel. The closest amusement park is... Odaiba. I mean, you would know. Oh, yeah. Their Ferris wheel is being repaired. The next closest one would take 30 minutes to reach. What should we do? Huh? There's a good place nearby? Lead the way. But make sure it's somewhere with a Ferris wheel. I'll take him to Under Kowloon level 1. Yeah, there's a Ferris wheel in Underground Lu. Kulu, whatever it's called. Kowloon. Yes, I don't Cow, need you to... and then loon, as in Looney Tune. Listen, I, I am not your speech therapist. Don't, don't you, don't, don't you mean it the other way around? <laughs> I know what I said. Alrighty, time to go to Kowloon. Walled city. No, we wouldn't want to go in there anyway. Fucking dude, if we went in a time machine back in time to like the to like the mid to late eighties into. The walled city of Kowloon, it'd be freaking terrifying. Because we wouldn't fit. Really? It, dude, those those hallways were tiny. Oh. And apparently the food was hyper cheap, but, you know. Uh, did he say under Kowloon or regular Kowloon? Under Kowloon. Under Kowloon 1. Okay, so I think you're right. Oh, yeah, there are the two Ferris wheels. Not even just one. It's got a bunch of Ferris wheels. Kisuke, 
Is this the Ferris wheel? Mm, how are we supposed to ride it? <coughs> it doesn't look like the door is open and it won't stop. There's no way to get on. Never mind, we can just look at it and imagine we're riding it. Um. <laughs> Oh, we're doing this roleplay again. You said you wanted to come here, too, at night. Oh, God. The nighttime scenery is so beautiful, you. I hate this. I know. Oh, don't rock it. We're so hot. Oh, okay. I at The moment I said don't rock it, I thought of his Gross. Uh, are you scared of heights? No, but rocking it could be dangerous. <laughs> oh my god, my mind, why? Dude, this is a, this is a horrible rom-com anime right now. I know. If I happen to slide closer to you, I don't think I can help myself. Uh, I think we're trapped in a freaking Ferris wheel with a predator here. Yeah, mm, yeah, there we go, Keisuke. Yeah, Yusuke is definitely a predator. <laughs> Keisuke, do you think we could hold hands? Just until we reach the bottom. Uh... You, just confess your fucking feelings, bro. I mean, at this point, yeah. Yeah. You, are you serious? Oh, if he leans in for a kiss. Ha. <laughs> you were so into it. I didn't think you'd take it that far. Oh, okay. Uh -huh. Yeah, sure. Okay. Projecting Whatever. much. Mm -hmm. Definitely. I've seen scenes like that on TV. I just thought I would try messing with you. Yeah, sure. Okay. Hey, lovebirds. Oh, no. This is a public place. Get a room. Are you trying to make me feel bad for being single? Uh, talk about fucking projection and jealousy. What are you talking about? Of course not. Oh, uh, don't fool me, Missy. Uh. Oh. Now have you gone and made me mad? Get out of here! Jeez, K. If you won't do as I said, then I'll just have to make you. Oh, wow, look, a mud Frigimon. Yeah, I haven't seen those guys in a while. Indeed. Not since you did the perfect voice for him before. I forgot what was the what was the perfect voice. I mean, you use your voice changer. Ah, that's what I did. All right, let's deal some damage. B -b 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 oh, oh, I was hoping to deal. I did, I only did a bit. Okay, uh, the destruction cannon. There we go. Much for Jumon's taking that fast that hit. Looks like we gotta grind a little bit in this game. I mean, it has been a while, so... Oh, no! Oh, that tickled. That also tickled. That actually kind of stung. Alright, uh... Alright, let's see if a wind attack does anything. Nothing. Well, we'll try it out. We'll, we'll beat him up. Uh, destruction cannon, welcome palm. All right. There we go. That's the kind of damage I want to see. After we're done with this mission, we're going to double check the evolution requirements to see if we can get to Mega yet. Because mm -hmm. that's what we need. Oh, dude, uh, so... Talk to me, Bio. When was the last time you played the Digimon card game? Yeah, uh, oh, shit, maybe after the Booster Box 6 or 7 or 8? Oof. Yeah, it's been a while. Yeah, I mean, there's been quite a bit of support for Machine Dramon and stuff, so I was just like, I wonder if he's played it lately. No, I have not. Uh, I know Creos gave me a Machine Dramon deck, but I think it's out of date. Uh, there is a new tamer for him, though. I will say that. His name is Marvin Jackson, and he could absolutely help that deck, so... 
If you ever wanted to pick it up again, you let me know. Yep. Marvin Jackson, I know that name. Yeah, because he was in the uh, Digimon uh, Seekers online novel. Because that's what Digimon's doing for, like, their uh, media right now. They're doing web comics and web manga and web novels. Oh, are they? Uh, Digimon Liberator is actually really good. I it, it when I so Digimon Liberator is the web comic, and it also has a novel side to it, so it tells two different stories. When I read, because uh, every Friday I read it with friends, dude, I'm telling you, Liberator feels like I'm reading a Digimon World Three comic, but it's only based on the card game, and I'm like, that's cool. It's cool because they're putting in new Digimon, and it's it, it's just fun. I'm glad. I'm glad that something's happening. Who knows? Maybe they'll turn it into a freaking anime. That'd be fantastic. Yeah, I'm sure they will. If it gets enough traction, they will. Or a movie. A or movie. or a short, you know, or a short series of movies. Like, try. Honestly, I wish they made an anime based on Dig the Digimon World game. Dude, you know what? I'd watch it. 100% I'd watch it. Because like we need we need we need more lore of the analog man, and uh, Mameo as well. That's the kid, mm -hmm. by the way. I hope the two of you are very happy together. Uh, the fuck! I can't tell if he was complimenting us or just being a dick. Who? Yeah, both. It looks like you saved my bacon. Won't be the only thing I'm saving for you. <laughs> Thanks for protecting me, Keysuke. It's Keysuke. Whatever. But I'm the boyfriend today. That should have been my job. Why did you have to go and do that? Does you even have a freaking team of Digimon? It was pretty cool, though. Just a shame, that's all. Whatever. Let's go to the next place. There's, there's one more place. It's the last one, and it's a classic. Of course. Wow, this coffee is exquisite. I know it's just normal for us, but a cafe is a classic spot for a date. You didn't like today's case, did you? You didn't mind. That's good. Two guys going to date spot together would be pretty embarrassing to some people. But no matter how uncomfortable you were, you still did it. Do you remember that time I really wanted to go to the haunted house as a kid? We went to that amusement park, the small one so far away. I've only ever seen a haunted house on TV. Even though I really wanted to go, I was too scared to do it by myself. I forced you to go with me. You cried and yelled about how you didn't want to, but I wouldn't give up. In the end, you said you'd do your best. Then when it was actually time to go, it was me who cried. You comforted me. Oh, he has feelings for him bad. Real bad. And do you remember? I remember it like it was yesterday. Have you got a little more time? I want to buy you a piece of cake to thank you for helping me out. Come on, let's go. Yeah, buy him a piece of cake. More like he wants yeah. to give you oh. his cake. Turn, turn, turn. Yeah, turns out the cake was his ass. <laughs> Jesus Christ, you like it? It you can cut the fucking tension with a knife here, bro. He, here's fine. Thanks for today. I verified the date spots. I got to spend time with you for the first time in ages. I had fun. Was that the whole reason you just wanted to spend time with 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 your with your guy crush? By, the fuck. By the way, which of today's places did you like best? The, the Ferris fish. Wheel. Ferris wheel. Yeah, because we fucked up that guy. Yeah, but. Come on, we gotta explain dominance to him. He can't be the the boyfriend. <laughs> I'll see. I'll remember that. See you later. Bye. That wasn't weird at all. It's been a long time since I've had such a relaxing day. Yeah, sure, relaxing. I've been super rushed lately. 
You must have... You must have known I needed this. Well, I better get back to Huddy. Hmm. Huh. Has he actually got any friends other than me? No. You're the only dick for me. Gross. Alright, uh... Let's check our messages, and then complete this shit. Uh... Oh god, we got quite a few. A uh, farm training too is complete. Toy Agumon. My friend said the farm is safe. No. My friend said the farm is safe, but it's dangerous outside, right? So scary. If you want me to take you off the farm to fight, you need to train hard. Sumemon is all the way at max level. Oh shit, alright. The farm is great. It is, it is so laid back and relaxed here. Is it the same out there? If you want me to take you off the farm... That's the same shit I just said. Are you want to do Mark Galgamon? Mark Galgamon? Oh, I'll try. How about you bring something nice to eat next time you come? I'll be waiting. Okay, I'll think of something. Alright, there we go. Uh, let's complete this mission. Because we're already getting to close to the 30 minute mark. There we go. I was, I was also about to say, like, we were... Oh, shit, we're getting a big-ass cutscene. How do you know? That It always happens when they make a save. Then that should be the opening for the next episode, then. You think so? You're probably right. Yeah. Uh, we're going to go ahead and end it, end it here, guys, because Bio has a point. If we're going to get a big old... Uh, uh, Cutscene. We should probably start it off with. We should probably start it off with that next time. Um, but yeah, bio. Is there anything you want to tell the good people at home? Subscribe now. Yes, please. We also recently hit 500 subscribers, and we'd love to get to a thousand sooner. So please subscribe, slap the like button, leave us a comment. We like talking to our viewers. Uh, what do you guys think of this game? Do you want to see us play through Digimon World Three? Do you also agree that you has a massive hard on for Keisuke. We definitely think so. Until next time, everyone. Take care. Bye, gold!